We recognize that food insecurity is a major issue for the populations that we serve. And through that um, understanding on the part of the Urban League and the No Hunger Campaign with Tyson, we found it to be just a wonderful partnership. So we look at the relation between community and business and education. Tyson fits right there in the middle because they're providing opportunities for us to learn about how we grow our food, how we provide food safety, but also relieving hunger in our communities. With the Family Supper, we take a meal to a community and then we talk to, to the families about education and those kinds of things. And Tyson has been involved in that from almost the beginning of that initiative. And that really points to that uh, public and private and, and partnership that can happen between communities and, and corporations to make sure the families have what they need. Over the past two years, we've had some wonderful opportunities with Tyson and the No Hunger Campaign. Uh, we did the HBCU Wellness Expo two years ago. Uh, that was sort of the inaugural event for the No Hunger Campaign in Nashville. Uh, we've invested in um, community food advocates and the Nashville mobile market. Uh, and they, of course, provide meals to families across greater Nashville uh, on, on a daily basis. And so that has been a very significant investment. And then we've had an opportunity to educate leaders about uh, SNAP, the Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program, and hunger awareness through SNAP challenges. So all of those, I think, have offered an opportunity for us to elevate the conversation about hunger. We're so grateful to Tyson for their support of the HBCU Wellness Project because this project is perfectly in sync with our goals to influence the health of the communities by training students who will go out and do those things. So we're very excited about Tyson and I look forward to keeping the working, working with them going forward. So thank you. No Hunger Challenges are the, just the perfect combination of fun, energy, a little competitive spirit. But at, at the end of the day, it really comes down to that really serious moment of, all right, we had fun, this was a competition, but this is what people deal with on a, a weekly basis. The best thing about the No Hunger Nashville Project has been to be able to bring so many different organizations to the table to get engaged with solving a problem. What we've hoped is that we have made some impact to bring those thought leaders to the table to continue those conversations about how additional progress can be made.